So I want you all Honda people out there who changes these sprockets. I want you to guys understand when you buy these sprockets, they come in unlocked position. Okay. Now you see that needle right there. That's that behind this bolt. It's the needle, the little, the little part, the little uh, empty hole is on the side. Now, after you torque this down, what was the spec? 85. 85 foot pounds. Oh, after you torque this down, after you got all the timing, everything is in place, okay? And you torque the, the back camshaft in there, you torque that down to what, 55 or some shit? Yep. Whatever, torque that down and torque this down, right? After you torque everything down, make sure it's unlocked position. The unlocked position is where you don't see the hole. You are not going to see that hole. If you see that hole and you're torquing this down, you're breaking the, you're breaking the new part. Make sure you torque this down without that hole being there. Now, we are going to lock this camshaft, okay? Actuator, we're gonna lock this. The way to lock this, after you torque it down, after you torque everything down, okay? You got your you got your tensioner installed, you got everything installed, you're just going to lock this cam right now, camshaft, okay? All right, so this is how you lock it. You got everything on there. All you have to do is just turn the camshaft, okay? Counterclockwise, and the little, spring in there is gonna go took okay watch this you see that not turning as i turn the camshaft all right hold on i'm gonna turn it more until it clicks into spot there you go that's it it's clicked you can't turn anymore you can't turn the cam so what did you do it. cameraman so they can see it cameraman okay now it's not going to turn i'm trying to turn this wrench it's not turning now that this sprocket is locked in place it's ready to go you can start the car and drive out of here that's it thanks for watching and all you people out there who don't understand the lock position and lock position this is how you do it you buy these things these things they this is locked right now this is unlocked position okay they come unlocked okay so you can install this okay there's ways of unlocking if you fuck it up and you gotta start all over you gotta unlock this you have to unlock it and then you gotta install it, torque it down. After you torque it down, unlocked position, torque it down, and then you turn the camshaft. Okay, you turn the camshaft, and this will turn. You gotta turn it, of course, counterclockwise because the unlocked position is right here. And you turn it counterclockwise, and it clicks, and it stays in there. The springs inside, they click into the spot. Okay, they click into the spot. You're gonna hear a click, click. This won't turn. If you turn the camshaft, this will not turn. Okay, the camshaft will turn. The camshaft will turn and this will stay in position and then it'll go click and that's it, it's locked. If you jiggle it back and forth, it's not gonna move. The camshaft here, it's not gonna move. So this is right now is tight, chain is tight, tensioners, everything is tight, everything is in place. Now we got a zip tie on this side. If you see, we got a zip tie so we don't, so we don't drop the chain down. What we did is we took this camshaft out, bolt, we took that out, we took this out and we took the tensioner out and then it got all everything got loose okay everything is loose and then now you take this out nicely put it back both of them at the same time and you're done that's how you do this thank you